the new improved X1 Pro Evolution press-up device. Only question is, are you tough enough? Hello and welcome to fit to box channel. I'm coach Simon and here on fit to box channel I bring you all things boxing equipment. Today is the turn of the X1 Pro Boxing Evolution press-up devices and as you might remember I did a review of the previous version of these, the model sort of one, and these have changed and improved and I'm going to go through that today. Okay so let's just have a look at the box as you can see there X1 Pro Boxing Evolution on the side it says X1 Pro Trainer for increasing punching power. Uh, package contains two pieces. Package dimensions 81 millimeters by 81 millimeters by 96 millimeters, and package weight 150 grams. Material elastomeric. Uh, but I think it's like rubber that is elastomeric and also it says maximum user weight 130 kg um, so it's protected by a patent and also you can go onto that uh, QR code and you can sort of get onto the website for, via there located in Kazakhstan and there you go Kazakhstan on the actual back that flag obviously triple G comes from Kazakhstan and it says they're curious about varying punching power in boxers I pondered this mystery upon discovering the crucial elements I developed the X1 Pro Boxing Evolution a trainer designed to enhance punching power Ruslan Murat okay so he's the guy that's actually come up with it and then on the back here it says explosive punching power the X1 Pro's innovative design and patented boxing grip are designed to develop explosive punching power that's transferring the load to the striking bones of your hand strengthening stabilizer muscles elevate your stability and wrist strength through push-ups and static exercise engaging critical arm and body stabilizer muscles hand injury prevention targeting small hand muscles and bones the x1 pro reduces the risk of common hand injuries ensuring you stay injury free and it says muscle control mastery quickly tense and relax your muscles for enhanced control over your punches allowing you to deliver power with precision experience a dynamic load on the wrist muscles that will truly astonish the muscles delivering swift and noticeable results so that is the box then as you can see on the top there uh, Ruslan Murat boxing and let's have a look at them so I get them out of the box and so you can see straight away the first ones were like a red color and straight away these are black and you've also got the two red fists and the X1 there and on the front there combat sports pro boxing and as i say that's like a really hard rubber and then i'll bring that round as well and then you can see that on the rear okay so it says the bottom there evolution if you can just pick that up um the first ones that bar there wasn't as as wide as that and also they've done some shaping here so it alters the angle of the press up okay so when it comes to press ups i think that these do take press ups to a whole new level and, and i do think that forearms i would say in the uk if i went into a gym very very rarely i would see anyone doing forearm training biceps yet shoulders yet chest yet forearms very very rarely and in boxing i think what they've got in sort of the eastern bloc countries so i would say that they are more aware of the importance of sort of forearm muscles in punching power and that's why um, they have developed these ruslan murat has developed these and i think that he's onto something although that does come with some quite big caveats which i will cover later
So obviously you will start off, you, you've got to be able to do good quality press ups with the flat of your hand first of all. If you can't do that then there's no point in buying these. I would also say get into a position where you're very comfortable doing knuckle press ups on wooden floors and you're there and you can do loads of them before you buy these. These are a tough exercise to do and if you think you're just going to go straight from this from sort of a normal press up I think you're going to struggle. Not only will you struggle in the muscle area but you'll also struggle with the pain that you will get on the knuckles. These are definitely something that you need to build up with and definitely something that you need to condition your not only your knuckles but your hands, your forearms and, and your arms to use. So this is not a novice device. This is a device for experienced boxers. I, I want to stipulate that because I would hate for any of you to, to rush out if you're a novice boxer or, or someone that's not very good at press ups and you rush out to buy these then I think that you will be wasting your money because these are going to take some perseverance to get used to. Okay so of course with press ups you can do flat press ups also you can get the bar press ups as well so you can get a deeper press up and also you've got the ones where they've got the twist and they're quite a big unit and you can you can twist with them these are a step on from those okay so out of all of those types of press ups these are the most difficult in my opinion Okay, now what they've done is, as I'll bring that round, they have got improvements to here, so a more comfortable enlarged grip. There is a slight incline as well for the knuckle impact, okay, so that is when your knuckles are in that position there, so as you can see, and you're doing the press up on there. You can also, I've seen people do them when they're in the middle, like so. Okay, so either of those, although with the actual owner, he does them like that. That creates additional load to not only the knuckles, but the hands, the wrist, the forearms, and also, obviously, they do press-ups working the uh, arms, shoulders, and of also chest as well. So these are black with the red, made of rubber, as I say, and also what I do like about them is they are small enough to take pretty much anywhere. So if you was going on holiday, you could easily put them in a little bag. Not like the perfect push-up ones, which are quite, quite big. These are really small. You could carry them anywhere. So here is my word of warning. Get yourself great at knuckle press ups first because these are gonna hurt. If you suddenly just start doing these, you're really gonna feel it on the knuckle area. These device is not for the faint hearted. You have gotta, I would say, you've gotta enjoy pain first of all because they are painful to use. I know that they did bring out um, a version where there was almost like a, like a piece there that was cushioning. They've done away with that. I don't know why, but they've done away with that. Now all you get is this. I really do think that that does need some sort of cushioning or something to make it more comfortable for the user. Now, I did try and I did use uh, these, you know, my uh, school tech gel pads. I use them for a lot of different things. And I have to say, they made them a little bit more comfortable. But on their own, these are not comfortable to use and you definitely need to get used to it and that would I would say is you've got to persist and also you've got to do it gradual and build up. Do they provide a fantastic workout? Yes they do but it does come at a cost and that cost is knuckle pain especially at first. There is a general warm-up there is on 
the website uh, ruslanmarat.com. These are 49 US dollars or 39 UK pounds. Now let me tell you, that's a lot of money if you only use them a couple of times. Okay, and there's a real, real uh, risk that you will do that because with these, you know, they look, when you're doing them and you see people using them, they look easier than they are. They definitely are a tough workout and you need to be advanced to use that and I really want to sort of stress that in these. I've given them two fit to box stars, great, but I'm only giving them great for those experienced hardened boxers or the bare knuckle guys whose hands are conditioned to take that knuckle strain. I am not giving them two fit to box stars great if you are a novice boxer who barely does any press ups. Again, I can't labour that point enough. These are for proper beast mode, they are not for the faint hearted, but have a look at them. If you think that you're up for the challenge of these, then obviously check them out. As I say, 49.99 US dollars or 39 pounds is a lot of money for you to invest if you use them once or twice and you give up because your knuckles are hurting too much. You definitely need to be persistent and you definitely need to like pain. I am a pleasure seeker. Uh, I don't uh, seek out any pain. So these are a tough sell for me in terms of that because as I say, I would say the way for these to get more stars from me, they need to get away that these are more comfortable to use than they currently are. They are hard, uh, yeah it's rubberized but it's quite a stiff rubber that is there and you definitely, definitely feel it on those knuckles. So there's the warning, two fit to box stars, great. I do think the actual innovation and the features on it are great but it comes at a cost and that cost is pain. Hope you enjoyed that. Please like and subscribe to Fit to Box channel and I shall speak to you soon.